Guns, violence, and drugs are alarming issues in today's society. Golden Triangle Crime Stoppers met today in West Point to figure out ways to make the area safer. WTVA's Chris Nalls talked to law enforcement officers in West Point about those fighting crime. Guns. Guns and drugs. Drugs, juveniles, and bad decisions. Golden Triangle law enforcement officers say that drugs, guns, and juvenile crime are the biggest issues facing the area. And there's no such thing as a fist fight anymore. It seems like everybody just wants to pull a gun and start throwing. Officers say that juveniles used guns at a Starkville Sprint March shooting recently. Starkville Police Chief Mark Ballard says in March and April, he has taken away at least nine handguns from underage teen. It's really a sad thing because this is our future that's being lost. If it doesn't put them in a prison somewhere or in jail, it's going to put them in the ground. Pictured are all guns collected from the Starkville PD. Another alarming crime in the Golden Triangle area is auto burglary. Police tell me that robbers will search for unlocked vehicles, then take valuables such as electronics, money, and weapons. They tell me many of the weapons used in juvenile crime have been directly linked to auto burglaries. Uh, most of the time, a, a juvenile gets a gun this way. He can't purchase a gun legally, so... He has to get it by other means. The Clay County Sheriff says gun violence doesn't just affect two people, but everyone in the area. They're shooting up houses, they're shooting up cars in the middle of busy intersections. It's putting the public so much at risk. He's asking parents to step in and help with the problem. We need parents to step up. We need the grandparents, aunts, whoever to help us get involved with this. That was Chris Knoll's reporting. The sheriff says that one resolution to these crimes is community involvement. He says one way is to call Crime Stoppers. The call is anonymous and he says it helps everyone.